coming up in Mizzerktastic. anywhere, anytime, hundreds of different art lessons directly to your home. Perfect for families and classrooms. Hi there, I'm Ms. Artastic and today we're going to learn all about cats. Cats, the household cat, were domesticated around 7,500 before Common Era, BCE. That is a very, very long time ago, thousands of years ago. There are over a hundred different types of cats and hundred different varieties or breeds of household cats. Did you know that household cats can see up to 120 feet away? That is a long, long distance. So that makes their eyesight pretty good. So we're going to play a game where we're going to guess the breed or type of household cat. I'm going to put up a picture and you're going to try and guess the breed of cat. Ready? Can you guess this cat? It's a Siamese cat. All right, here's the next one. Can you guess this cat? It's a Maine Coon. Can you guess this cat? This is a Persian cat. Can you guess this cat? This is a rag doll. Okay, one more. Can you guess this cat? This cat is a sphinx. All right, let's head on over to the art studio where we're going to learn how to draw a kind kitten and then we're going to draw or make an artwork for a cute cat. See you there. All right, we're going to make our kind kitten. Let's draw using whatever you want to draw with. You want to cross with two little lines up and down with a V. Zigzag lines down. Lines across. And then we'll just add a little line down. Curving line for a tail. Curving line down. Next we'll add a little line in the center of the face. And then we'll make it like a bubble letter T to make a cute kitty nose. Two lines out for the mouth. We'll make big kitten ear eyes. We're gonna add a big circle and a small circle. And we'll add another circle around. So the pupil is hiding back there. Oh my gosh, it's gonna be so cute. Okay, triangles in each ear. Color that retina nice and Maybe it's like thinking about love and kindness. We'll just add some thought bubbles and a little circle above and the heart above to symbolize how kind our kitten is. So cute. Okay, let's go ahead and color it in with your choice of art making mediums and colors.
like that, our little kitten is done. All right, we're going to create a cat using some wax crayons and our tempera paint. And then we're going to paint the background with cool colors. Let's do our cute cat. We're going to draw one, two ears, just using our wax crayon, just two upside down V's. Next, we're gonna do a line to connect between the ears. And then connect down to the bottom. Let's draw a triangle in each ear. Let's draw a line across the face, just a nice little line. And then we'll make a V below. Below we'll draw a line with two lines on a diagonal. Let's draw a circle on either side. And in each circle, let's draw another small circle. And then I like to color in the dark of the eyes, leaving the little circles white. Let's add little ovals under the eyes. Then we'll add a tail with a curving line and bring it back down. Let's do a divider background in two lines. So we'll add lines across. Let's paint it. We're gonna grab our paintbrush. We're gonna dip it in water first. We're gonna dip it in some pink. And we can paint the inner ears and the little cheeks with our pink. Oh, and our nose. Next, we're going to paint the background with cool colors. And our cool colors are green, blue, purple. Cool colors are green, blue, purple. Green, blue, purple are cool colors. So we'll dip our brush in water. And then we'll use our tempera paint, or if you want, you can use watercolors. I'm gonna pick another cool color.
I'll pick my next cool color and I'm gonna do purple. Just like that, your cat with a cool color background is done. Well, my friend, that's it for this episode. If you have completed these artworks and you had tons of fun, please give this video a big thumbs up to show your appreciation and subscribe to this channel. If you complete these works and you snap a picture uh, with your phone, whatever device, make sure you so share them to social media and take me at Ms. Artastic or use the hashtag Ms. Artastic so that I can check out your completed works. As well, if you're looking for some more art ideas that you can do at home or in a classroom, grab my free guide up here. It's super easy to download and check out lots of different art ideas that you can do at home, anywhere, anytime. And if you're wanting to access my art lesson library full of hundreds of different art lessons, make sure you head on over to artastickids.com and join the Artastic Kids online membership so you can make art anywhere, anytime, on any device using some really fun art mediums. See you in the next episode.